I do start school tomorrow, literally within the next 24 hours, and I still have not gone back to school shopping. I have a lot of things that I need to get done today. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I want to do some extreme organizing, update my Notion, update my Google Calendar, update my academic planner. I also want to go to Target and get some shopping done. I have a package that I've been meaning to open that has so much cute stationery, and I just need to show you guys all of it. Some pampering before the school year starts tomorrow. Kind of taking a step back. I am the type of person that gets so stressed out because of school. I don't think it's that deep, but like I make it deep. Me getting anything lower than like a B makes me want to cry. Grades do not define you. But anyways, let's get this video started. I hope you guys enjoy. I am currently stressing out. Yay! I'm trying to register for classes, and so much of these classes are already full. These classes do start tomorrow. I'm basically waitlisted to like three classes that I really wanted to take this semester. I literally looked up open courses only. Half of these classes are closed, like they're not open. And now the AC turned on. Hello? I have a question. <laughs> Gains of Celsius. <laughs> I got some packages that I have been meaning to open. So many of these things are like back to school essentials. I don't know anything about me. You would know that I am obsessed with stationery. I think it's the one thing that I look forward to when it comes to back to school season. The first thing I wanted to open is actually from Stationery Pal, who is sponsoring a back to school giveaway. I'll be giving some more information on that later. Stay tuned. <laughs> I'm so excited for cute stationery. Less than bucks. Oh, I'm so happy! I got so many little notebooks. It has a really cute checkered pattern and it says sunny day on it. It has grid paper in it. I think it's so cute. Uh oh, I got lipstick on it. And then I also got these campus notebooks. I wasn't expecting them to be this tiny, but I still think they're really cute. Definitely a great dupe for a composition book. I got this spiral notebook. They're just so cute. This brown notepad, just for funsies. I also got so many new pens. I also got one pencil. It's literally Rila Kuma with her friends, and I just think it's so cute. Like, I want to take it out of the packaging, but I also don't because the packaging is just so freaking stinking cute. I'm obsessed with Muji pens. I got three black ones, and then one pink one. I've never seen a pink Muji pen. Oh, I'm so excited. I also got this little pack. I love these pastel highlighters. They sell them at Target as well. I have no idea what this is. But it's really cute. Pink pen as well. Brush sign pen also in pink. I'm so excited. Yay. A Sanrio characters mild liner. It has Hello Kitty and her friends on there. I also got a black pen. This is Koromi. I cannot pronounce any of the characters names. I'm so sorry. But I just think it's adorable. And then I also got this green eyelid pen. Tabs or books, girl flower themed. Also got this air and red one tape to kind of decorate your notes. I was like, it's so cute. Basic pattern tape, these cool colors, some stickers. Thought they were gonna be a little bit bigger, but they definitely are on the smaller end. I just love them. Definitely gonna be messing around with these later. Ah! I also got some sticky memo, that's what they call them. For writing down to-do lists. It's just gonna motivate me to write down to-do lists every single day. I don't know, I just think this is like up. I got a lot of cute freebies. Thank you so much Stationery Pal for sending me these products. Stationery Pal is actually holding a back to school sale. Be sure to check out stationerypal.com. I also got this package from Papier. <laughs> I got this really cute weekly planner. I love how you can literally personalize everything. I put my name on all of the things that I got from Papier. Then I also got these notepads. I love them so much. They're in the little pack. This one is focused on sustainability, which you guys know I am super passionate about. This one says, Fab, let's talk. Totally giving clueless vibes. I also got this one that has cute flowers on it and also it has my name on it. I just think they're so cute. I'm just obsessed with them. They're just like my favorite thing in the world. Like I also got this academic planner 
that matches my weekly planner. I'm so excited to write in this later on in this video. It's such a great way to organize. Oh, they actually have a finance planner thing back here too. That's so sick. Finally, I got this notebook that has these cherries, smiley faces, and flowers. I'm just so excited to use this. <laughs> they also gave me this really cool pen. I'm literally set for life. I have so many pens now. Who needs this much pens? Surely not me, but you know I have them now, so I'm gonna use them. This is something that I actually bought with my own money. This isn't really like stationary, but it definitely is something that I'm gonna be using before we back to school. Y'all, guess in the comments down below. Guess what it is. Ah, it's so cute! I got a Kira Lakuma AirPod case. You need to put it in. Put it that in there. Ah! go ahead and like take a breather because I'm just overwhelmed with excitement right now. This is gonna be so excited for back to school. Literally, I don't even know. We're gonna go to Starbucks. I need to finalize which classes I'm gonna be taking this semester. I need to go to campus to figure out some things with my college advisor. So let's go do that. As a sad it's a sad for school. Back to school season, baby. Target my heart I'm gonna cry. I'm so annoyed, but it's okay because thank god Target has stationery all year round This is supposed to be school supplies. Target ruined my thunder man. <laughs> oh my gosh. These are so cute This is not supposed to be Halloween related Um, this is what I get to try to go back to school shopping one day before school starts and then also literally in September What was I thinking? I have no idea. We're gonna go look at the school supplies. My cart is empty they're kind of cute. Do I need them? Not at all, but they are adorable. 10.99, ladies, gents. I'm trying to find boulders, and it looks like these are the only ones they have, which is unfortunate because I'm not a fan of this bright freaking mustard yellow. Let's see if they have any more. I don't think I like those ones either. Dang, I may or may not have to go to Office Max. I literally just need one folder. Don't want to have to take my binder every day to school. It's a little bit bulky, so I just want to be able to take like one folder and be chilling. You know what I mean? I just can't find any. <laughs> This is what happens when you try to go back to school shopping in freaking mid-September. It's fine. These are my favorite pens. So where it's at? These are so cute. They have extra colors. I got these like three years ago. They only had a pastel, but not the blue and gray. They even have neon green. It's so adorable. I want these so bad, but I don't really need them. And the eraser kind of sucks, not gonna lie. It does not really take off the highlight. False advertisement. These are all kind of mid. They're out. Oh, why did I just sound like Peppa Pig? Blah. We're back in the book section, baby. I do ride the public transit, so it would be nice to have a book to read on the bus while I get to and from school. I'll try to pick up a fiction book and then also non-fiction book where I can, you know, get some wisdom and knowledge and stuff. I want this book! section. I stuff to put in my backpack so that I can have self-care, personal hygiene. Oh, I should probably get pads. Next, I'm gonna be looking for a white notebook. I'm pretty sure they have one here. I don't think they have any white five-star notebooks, but they definitely do have these stellar knockoff brand. I don't think I'd like that though, because it kind of looks like it's wide ruled. I'm not a fan of wide ruled. Wide ruled. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get this stellar notebook. It's kind of like a five-star knockoff. How does this page look like this page? They look so different. Yeah, bro, it's just weird. It's a trip. I definitely think I learned a lesson from this back-to-school shopping trip. Just do your shopping in like July, like a month in advance, not one day before class starts. If I was doing any actual textbook work, I would totally get these. I think they're so cool. I saw them trending on TikTok. They're essentially translucent sticky notes where you can write on them like the image implies. Yo, these are really cool. They're basically copying mild liner. These are literally the only folders that they have here. <laughs> 
quick Target haul. As you guys saw, the back to school section at Target was like non-existent. Still ended up getting some things that I felt like I needed for it this school year to kind of make it the most enjoyable. I'm trying to romanticize school. Honestly, it ain't that deep. I just spent a lot of money for no reason. But anyways, I got a few books. So the first one that I got was The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. I saw this book all over TikTok. I needed to get my hands on it. I also got another Coho book and this is Brandy. So excited to read this. It's actually kind of a little thriller slash mystery vibe. I've never read one of those books before. It does have some romance in it. So I'm a sucker for that. Really hoping that I get a good read out of this book. I also got a book by Sadie Robertson. She is so on fire for God. Honestly, I have no idea what this book is about, but she looked cute in the picture. I'm just interested in learning more about the way that she goes about living. I also got some snacks. Dark chocolate covered freeze dried mangoes. This snack variety pack by Annie's. Look at the little bunnies. It's not cute. That's adorable. Anyways, got these kind bars. These are dark chocolate nut and sea salt ones. I'm going to be eating one of these on my way back from school tomorrow. I don't want to go to school. Also, kind of random stuff, but things that I needed. Reusable facial round pads. They are natural, eco-friendly, breathable, and silky. I needed to get pads that I can have a few extras for my backpack. If Mother Nature calls, you know what I mean? A baby native deodorant. This is a coconut and vanilla one. I'm not a big fan of native deodorant, but for the couple of hours that it works on my order, it smells pretty good in case there's ever moments where I'm like, oh dang, I kind of stink. And I just need to apply some quick deodorant. I ended up going to office max i did get this white folder that i'm planning to decorate not so interesting but i'm gonna put stickers on it to hopefully make it a little bit more fun i also got these cute little erasers they're little fruits which i thought was fun they're giving elastic fair from like elementary school I also went to alta to pick up a few things as well this touchland aloe u power mist so it's essentially just a hydrating hand sanitizer that i can put in my backpack trying to not get sick trying to stay healthy i also got this super goop resetting freshing mist. I really want to get into the habit of reapplying sunscreen throughout the day, but I usually wear makeup so I can't put sunscreen on top of makeup. I can just spray spray in between classes, you know what I mean? Last but not least, I got a product from La Roche Posse. They were telling me in the comments that they're really good. I watched a few videos on some of the best products that they have, and this was one of them. This is basically kind of like an acne treatment. It also treats texture, which I kind of have on my forehead. I'm gonna go ahead ahead and shower and like get ready for bed. I did the shower. I shaved, I exfoliated, I smell like strawberries, I smell good. Literally was in the shower for like 25 minutes. Water bill, gonna be high. I wanted to do a face mask. I pamper myself. I wanna shave my face, my little mustache moment. Not a vibe. I might also pick out an outfit. I'm not trying to like rush and pick out a crappy looking not cute fit. I wanna dress and press, you know? I got this from Urban Outfitters the other day. Slay. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I want to put it on my face because it's scary. <laughs> this does not feel right, but we're just gonna go with it. Give me like five minutes. I don't know if I did this right. I tried. Kind of looks a little funny. I read the instructions and it says to put a timer on for 10 minutes. Siri, put a timer on for 10 minutes. So I got 10 minutes on now. I'll let that do its thing. I'm gonna be adding some onto my notebook and my folder. I also have these stickers that I got from my Pusheen calendar. You guys are always asking me where I got my calendar back here. I got it from Amazon. <laughs> Like this may have been a fail. This like really hurts. I'm gonna take it off. I'll be right back. Um, I kid you guys not. It's like 30 minutes later. I took so long to take that crap off of my face. But now we're going to resume with the skincare. I actually kind of want to do a little bit of shaving. Squeeze my eyebrows. I just don't think I want to show up to school with a little unibrow action. You know what I mean? I'm always scared to over pluck my eyebrows because I don't want them looking too thin. It is literally 
30 right now. I'm gonna have to be up in four hours. I do not know why I'm still awake. I thought it would be a perfect time to pack my bag. That tomorrow I don't have to like stress about packing my bag. The first thing I'm gonna be putting in the backpack is my laptop. This is the MacBook Pro 13 inch in space gray. She's a queen. I love her. There you go. Inside I have some loosely five star paper and then I also have a syllabus for my class which I'm not gonna show you guys. This notebook. This is essentially just gonna be a journal where I write anything that I want. Like write affirmations for myself and things like that. I also have this textbook that I haven't opened yet so I'll open it right now. This book is humongous. Thank God I don't have to take this with me tomorrow because this is like very heavy. I'm gonna be having a poetry writing class Monday and Wednesday and then I'm gonna have the class that I'm taking tomorrow which is a modern literature class. I have two other classes online which is the marketing 101 class and then this other class that I'm not really sure what it is quite yet honestly. I forgot what it was called. My academic planner which you guys saw but this is the spread that I made. I'm gonna have to go in and add the marketing 101 class and also the other class I'm gonna be taking this with me just in case they give us assignments so I can write them down in here. I'm also going to be taking this notepad. So I'll write my to-do list tomorrow morning in here. Verity by Colleen Hoover. So I can read it on the bus tomorrow. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm also going to be taking my pencil pouch, which I got from Amazon. I'll be sure to link it down below in my Amazon storefront. I put all of my pens in here. So I have a highlighter, a pen, another pen. I also have this, oh shoot, this whiteout stick thing. I have this highlighter from Stubby Mill Boss. Two mood pens one is pink and one is black it's really cute Hiromi pen i just think it's so adorable in the back i have my favorite pilot pen in 0.38 a lot of mild liners my real akuma pencil back here i haven't taken it out of the packaging because it's just so cute but i will eventually oh yeah want to take one of these little erasers with me i just think the strawberry is adorable there you go amazing i'm also going to be taking my wallet i've literally had this coach wallet for like years and it's so crusty i really want to get a new one i want a louis vuitton one so badly but it is so freaking expensive i'm also going to be taking my hydro flask it's kind of like a cute little lilac color and i got this from tilly's in this little pouch i'm going to put my keys i got this my melody keychain from amazon but i think she looks so cute so i'm gonna go put that in there two pads i'm also going to be taking aquaphor this is my favorite thing ever i'll probably get some lip gloss i usually put the lip products that i'm wearing in here so i don't know what i'm gonna wear tomorrow so can't put that in there yet this kind bar tissues which i'm going to be putting in the side pocket i honestly think i'm going to return this one and get a pink one i saw another altar had a pink one so i might return this one i'm definitely going to be putting in my sunscreen this is the super goop studying brushing mist thing um i think that's it for anyone wondering this is the kinkin 13 one but this is olive green i think it's like the forest green one and i've literally had it for like five years so yeah and the last thing i'm going to add to my backpack is this airpod case so i'm just gonna put that like so and and there you go. My backpack is done. <laughs> yeah. I'm so nervous. It's gonna be fine. Like, there's really nothing to be worried about. Whenever you start something new, it's totally normal to, like, feel anxious or to feel, like, a little bit nervous. So that's why I genuinely love journaling to kind of just calm my nerves down. Everything is gonna work out. As long as I trust in God, he got some back. Thank you so much, Stationary Pal, for doing this giveaway with me. This giveaway is going to be international. To enter, you have to, one, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also Stationary Pal's YouTube channel. Be sure to comment down below what grade you're going to be entering because I'm just a nosy girl. Comment an Instagram handle or even an email. Just a way that I can contact you. Please don't be putting in your phone numbers. The giveaway is going to be closing September 21st. I'm going to be contacting the winner and you guys are going to be winning this prize right here. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Love you guys. Right, welcome to my closet area. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to show you guys my closet. It looks a little chaotic. I definitely have some laundry down there that I gotta do, but it's okay. It's fine. We're chillin' like a villain. Shave my legs, so I'm thinking maybe I should wear shorts. I have these really cute shorts that I got from Princess Polly, and I also have these other ones that I literally wear religiously at this point from Zara. I think we're just gonna go with these ones. I also shaved my armpits, so maybe I can use a tank top. I'm kind of thinking this shirt that I got from Princess Polly, I can get a cardigan. I'm like 100% certain that the room that I'm gonna be in tomorrow for like my lecture is gonna be freaking freezing. Let me figure this out. Give me like two seconds. All right, I have no idea what I'm doing. Would this look weird? I'm not gonna wear this the whole time. I'm just gonna wear this when I'm in class cold. I need to get a cute white cardigan. This would look so cute with like a white cardigan. Yeah. 
<laughs> the AC is about to turn on. I'm so sorry, guys. I also have this cardigan, but I don't really know if I like it. Or actually, that doesn't look bad. I think this is the move. I'm pretty sure I'll end up just using my Air Forces. They're kind of gross right now, so I'm not going to show you them. I'm definitely going to have to wipe them off tomorrow. Put this on the stool right here, and we'll call it a day, babe. I'm nervous. Okay. Let's go journal. doing a quick little journal entry i literally just wrote down what i felt i also wanted to write down some goals that i have for this semester one of my goals is to get good grades i really want to try to get straight a's this semester and maintain my 4.0 average i also want to do my best to turn in all of my assignments on time i really struggled with that last semester literally last semester i remember doing assignments 15 minutes before they were due and it was just not a vibe i found myself getting so stressed out i also want to try to have less than three absences this semester last semester i literally missed several classes so i really want to make sure that i'm actually attending classes because i am paying for them might as well go i'm gonna put on my alarm for tomorrow see you guys in like three hours and 40 minutes i'm so nervous ah. i hope you guys enjoyed this video hope to see you guys in the next one god bless and good night <laughs>